what's up everybody naresh here welcoming you back into another video where today we are looking into ai enabled floodlight camera by enki i'm sure you must have noticed that what is ai guys this camera come with the artificial intelligence algorithm built in into it so it can differentiate actually that is it a human bird or a dog or whatever moving car actually so it can detect it and can raise an alarm by turning on the light also run 100 db siren and push a notification on your mobile phone too but the most important thing which i like the most about this product is that you can directly replace it with your security light if you got a flood light in your house you can directly wire it it's a hard wired system but all the communication will happen wirelessly camera come in two colors white and a black I'm sure you will find the one which will suit the decor of your home. Within my video, I tend to go extra mile, showing each and everything to my viewers that what you expect from the product and how you can configure it as well. So this video is no different at all. First to start with, we're going to look into the feature offered by this camera system, following with the what comes with it. I will also show you how you're going to install it outdoors, following with this working performance and how app works too. I hope it will cover each and everything and make your decision easier that is this camera for you or not. Now let's crack on with the features offered by this camera system. Starting with the full HD 1080p recording, AI algorithm, motion detection, light with high beam LEDs, support cloud and local storage recording with a micro SD card which can go up to 64 gigabytes. Feature of two-way audio communication, 100 dB siren as well so you can actually alarm or warn someone which you don't think should be there. 180 degree wide angle PIR motion detection with 127 degree ultra wide field of view. And I'm sure it's going to cover the area where you're going to install this camera flood light. Now within the packaging you get instruction manual explaining to you each and everything which I'm going to cover in the video as well. 124 hour video surveillance sticker for your window and a template to install the camera system. One complete installation kit. And now in last but not least AI enabled flood light camera system which is divided in two parts camera and a flood light but they both are interfaced together to work. Now in front of camera you have all the module which makes him AI enabled. Starting with the one 1080p full HD camera lens, PIR sensors, microphone input for two-way audio communication, siren to deturn and much more. Where on the back you have a reset button and a compartment to install your micro SD card as well as 100 dB siren. Camera module is fully customizable moving up and down to set your field of view to. And now the ultra bright LED flood light which is capable to deliver 2150 lumens at 5000K and you can also adjust it up and down left and right if you want to. Camera system is electric hard wire so if you're not confident to fit it I would highly recommend to hire one electrician possible. But if you have right tools and the guidance which is available in user manual you should be able to do the job no problem whatsoever the manufacturer also include two back plates which you're going to use to install this camera system you can select the one which suits your assembly system and that would be all installing micro sd card in your camera module is straightforward i am going for maximum 64 gigabyte make sure to check out the links in the video description for SD card you need. Also remember to check out all the bits and pieces available within the packaging before going ahead and installing this whole camera system outdoors. Would also highly recommend to power it up and configure it with your mobile phone when you install it outdoors. For my setup it's a very much straightforward. Let's go ahead and install this camera outdoor. Mobile phone application to access this flood camera is available for Android users as well as for Apple. And it's called KMB. Now meanwhile application is downloaded you can enjoy my installation guide make sure to do it all safe by turning off the circuit breaker of your outside light following with using the multimeter check there is no voltage available if not confident hire an expert electrician 
Now application is downloaded, open up first time, agree with the terms and condition and create a user account with Camby application. After creating and typing in your credential within the application, you will be on devices screen. Click on to the add a device. There are two ways actually to can deal with this matter. One by scanning the QR code available on the camera or by searching if you want to. The method of QR code is straightforward. But search is not that bad at all too. After that, you will be on this screen where you need to type in the credential for the Wi-Fi which will be used by your flood camera to connect to internet. You will also going to hear the notification on camera too. Connecting Wi-Fi. Connecting server. Please wait. Camera is now online. Now give it a name to your camera. You can give it any name you like but there is a limitation of characters. Now it's completely connected. Click onto the play. By using the live feed, you can set up the view as well if you want to. Alright, how much you would like to cover? Can be application for the floodlight camera is very easy and straightforward to work with and come with the very minimal and straightforward options to go to. To access the settings of your camera on the live feed, click onto the cog button. Within the settings, you can access the settings of your light that when you wanted to turn on light and how long for. And within the security setting, you can set the motion detection of your camera that you can only get the notification when a human comes in or all the notifications as well. You can also schedule the notifications too. Now, let's suppose if I set the all notification, then it will give me an option for the zone where I can set it what zone I wanted to cover on or what I don't. Once I'm done with it, I get out of it and confirm it. Now, whenever a motion is detected within that particular zone which you have specified, you will get the notification. But I want this floodlight to work only when a human is detected. So that's how I have set it. Next tab is the device information, showing you all about your device, following with the device timing, or which you can change if you want to. Ending with the device initialization, where you're going to get the option for reboot device and restore it to factory settings. Now on live feed you have a couple of options to go through. One to turn on the floodlight on and off which you can see that is raining at the moment of time. Okay. You can also record this all if you want to by press up of one button or take a picture of it as well. Everything will be stored on your mobile phone what you are doing at the moment of time. If you see somebody over there you can notify them by using the siren. By press up of one button you can turn on the siren as well which will flash your flood light and a siren as well. This is all live feed in full HD. You can see its quality. I have shown you the smooth one as well with it. Now all previously detected motions will be available within the history area here where you have option for cloud storage as well as the SD card if you want to. I have not bought the cloud storage but if you would like to buy it click on it and here are a couple of packages they offer available for you. To me I got a SD card that's what I was planning to use so let's go into the SD card. Now in here is going to show you that what motions were detected on the day actually. You can change the day as well so let's suppose if I go with the 6th of May click on it all the motion for 6th of May are available in here. You can select the one you wanted to go for. Let's suppose I have selected one of them. To get this footage into your mobile, click onto this plus button and press the record button. Now it will record whatever is playing for how long. You can just simply save the copy once the recording is completed. All the videos which you have copied from the history or you have recorded the live feed can also be available from my file section in here. Where you can have images. Go into the images. These are the images you captured available in here. And video files as well. You can select the video which you have stored on your mobile phone. Watch it and off you go. You, from here you can transfer it to anywhere you want it because the video is in your mobile phone. You can also share your floodlight device with other users as well. But click on to this share button and type in their account. The condition is they have to have an account with the KMB application. Now let's check out the two-way audio communication with this floodlight. Alright Mohit, can you hear me very clearly or is it just breaking? Not very clear. But I can hear you very loud and clear. That's very good. Can you say something else? If you like the video, press the like button. If you don't, press the like button. Let's check out how quickly we get the motion notification on our mobile phone device with only mobile data network working. 
camera just triggered in I can see the light in front of it as you can see that right there too it's too bright okay have we got the notification yes we have just got the notification we got the notification in 30 seconds that's not bad at all and it is all well arranged you can play it right from there and record it too if you want well now here we have a night time recording of this on the flood camera straight away as soon as i came in front of camera i got the notification on my smartwatch too which is enabled to be honest with you and seems to be working fine i did notice some issues with it as well the reason i am getting issues because of the network connection simple as that other than that it is working good now i'm actually about five meters away from the camera now I'm back again. Alright guys, this is a HD recording. That's alright. So guys, this is a HD recording. So guys, this is a daytime HD recording of this camera system. I suppose you can see me very clearly. And I also got the notification on my smartwatch too. Everything seems to be working perfectly fine. But you have to make sure that you have to be in a certain range of it. For the notifications and in the night time light to work as well now here i am ending this video with my conclusion i try to show each and everything about this camera features within this video to make your call easier as possible and now the feature and their working performance which i like the most within this whole camera system is starting with flood light it is pretty bright guys very decent bright actually and the motion detection on it works mint too floodlight is also integrated with siren which will make sure that it will warn intruder with the siren and light on and off motion detection and the notification part on my smartphone was working perfectly fine and the two-way communication was a bit shaky it might be possible that i have installed this camera system on a pretty much big height so the sound was not that clear to be honest with you now everything around the camera system was just perfect apart from the user application application came with very limited options in it actually that is my worry point to be honest with you and running the HD live feed was a bit of problem so I had to run most of the time the smooth view which wasn't that clear now this is my recommendation towards the Onki that try to improve the app otherwise the whole hardware system is perfectly fine and works great the price tag they have on the camera system is very competitive if you look into the its competitions which are probably the double of his price now even after having the less feature within the mobile phone application will I recommend this floodlight camera yes guys I will because the features which I have checked as per the specification they work great for me and the camera was pretty decent too now that will be completely all from my side now guys thank you very much for watching this video if you still have any more reservation please use the comment section down below and let me know what you think and if you're interested in purchasing this camera system link for that will be available in the video description along with the 25% off discount code now that will be completely all from my side guys if you like this video hit the like button if not double click on the dislike button that will do great for me thank you again for watching this video shall see you soon into another one bye for now